محمد وعلى آله وأصحابه أجمعين اللهم علمنا ما ينفعنا وانفعنا بما علمتنا وزدنا علما وعملا متقبلا يا أرحم الراحمين So we talked last time about تعوذ تعوذ or استعاذة close that door تعوذ or استعاذة What does استعاذة or تعوذ mean? What does استعاذة or تعوذ mean? Huh? استعاذة or تعوذ means what? أعوذ بالله من الشيطان الرجيم this phrase or this sentence is called what? What is it called? استعادة or تعوذ And we explained the meaning of أعوذ بالله من الشيطان الرجيم, right? What does that mean? What does أعوذ بالله من الشيطان الرجيم mean? Um, to, you say it before you're reading the Quran. What does it mean? It means, oh Allah, please protect me from the shaitan. MashaAllah. Al-Rajim means what? Rajim means what? Shaitan or Rajim? This is description oh. for Shaitan. What does it mean? Rajim means what? Cursed or brazed? Cursed. 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 Expelled. Humiliated. Outcast. All these meanings of Rajim. Okay? Shaitan is, is expelled from the mercy of Allah. Is expelled from the heaven. He cannot go up and listen to the angels talking. He is humiliated. Right? He is disgraced because he, he did not listen to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala's command. Right? So we seek refuge with Allah from the cursed, from the expelled, from the humiliated shaitan. Whenever we recite the Quran, also you say, A'udhu Billahi Minash Shaitan Rajim, when the shaitan whispers to you. As Allah says in the Quran, فَإِذَا فَإِمَّا يَنْزَ وَإِمَّا يَنْزَغَنَّكَ مِنَ الشَّيْطَانِ نَزْغُنْ فَاسْتَعِذْ بِاللَّهِ Whenever shaitan whispers to you something, to do something wrong, Right away, what do you say? A'udhu Billah. Means, oh Allah, protect me from shaitan and its whispers. Now, we're going to move to Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim. Do you remember A'udhu Billah? When do we say it? Do we say it only in the beginning of the surah or anytime we recite the Quran from anywhere? Anytime. Anytime, anywhere. Now, Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim. What, do, what, what does it mean first? Bismi means with the name of. Bismi, ism is name. Bismi means with the name of, by the name of, in the name of. Bismillah, in the name of? Allah. Allah. Ar-Rahman. Ar-Rahman means what? Rahman, the one who is very comprehensive in his mercy. He shows mercy to all creatures, not only to Muslims, not only to humans, even to animals. Doesn't Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala give the sun to everyone? <laughs> yeah. Does not everyone benefit from rain? Does not everyone benefit from the, the stars and from the mountains? So these are bounties that are restricted to Muslims or to all people? All people. All people. Also animals, don't animals benefit from rain, from plants, from this and that, right? Yeah. So that's the name of Allah Ar-Rahman. Means his love and care and mercy is comprehensive to all creatures. That's Ar-Rahman. Ar-Rahim, also it means very merciful, very loving, but only to the believers, or exclusively to the believers. That's particularly in the hereafter. In the hereafter, Allah will not show mercy to those who rejected Him, right? Will show mercy to those who accepted and believed in Him, subhanahu wa ta'ala, right? So Ar-Rahman is the one who is comprehensive in His mercy to all creatures. Ar-Rahim is the one who is merciful with the believers in particular, right? Ar-Rahman, he's very great in his mercy. Ar-Rahim, he's consistent in his mercy. He shows mercy to, be, to the believers in this world and, and in the next world. Now, that's the meaning of Bismillahir Rahman Rahim. Now, what does that mean? In the name of Allah, the most gracious, the most merciful. What does that mean, in the name of Allah? Means, if I'm reading... And I say in the name of Allah, the most gracious, the most merciful, what does that mean? That means I start my reading with the name of Allah. Seeking the blessings of the name of Allah. Seeking the help of Allah. Do you understand? And when you write, also write in the name of Allah. With the name of Allah. Means when you write, seek Allah's help. Seek the blessings of Allah's name. When you enter the masjid, you say Bismillah, right? When you put your clothes on, you say Bismillah, right? When you start speech, 
Everything that is important, you start, you start with Allah's name. Why? To seek His blessings. To seek His blessings, blessings and help. To seek His help as well. Right? And this is why we say Bismillah rahman rahim In the good things, when you make wudu, you have to say Bismillah. When you eat, you have to say Bismillah. When you open the door, you close the door, right? So every important action, you say Bismillah. Means, I start this action by the name of why? To seek his blessings and to seek his help, finally. Does it make sense? You start something important and something good with the name of Allah, then you do it in a way that doesn't please Allah? No. That doesn't make sense. So when you start something, when you do something good, you do it in the name of Allah and in the way that pleases Allah. That's Bismillah rahman rahim If someone does something wrong, he's going to steal. Something. He says, Bismillah. I'm gonna, Bismillah. Does that make sense? No. If he does this, he committed two sins. The first sin is stealing, and the second sin is using Allah's name in something wrong. Right? But you use Allah's name in the good things. Right? And you do the things in the way that it pleases Allah. You're gonna read Quran. In whose name? In Allah's name. You seek His help and blessings, and what else? You read it in the way that pleases Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. So three things. When we say Bismillah rahman rahim we remember three things. We seek Allah's blessings, Allah's help, and we do it in the way that pleases Allah. Is that clear? Yes. Now do you understand Bismillah rahman rahim yes. Who understood Bismillah rahman rahim like this before? Huh? Of course he taught us this. Sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. Jazakumullah khairan. Inshallah, next time we'll continue the, gold, the golden rules of memorizing the Quran. Watch oh, yeah. the old golden rules that we recorded so that, inshallah, we can follow up. Jazakumullah khairan. Everyone take class quickly.